how are you? Okay, well, you know, today we have the revisions on unit three and four, yes? But first of all, we are going to check, yes, we are going to check homework, yes, the activity book, okay? So it's third grade, third grade. We are going to check, what's the weather like today? Sunny, cloudy, rainy, windy? Yes, it's sunny, sunny and cold, and it's a beautiful day. Yes, okay, so we are going to check pages from the activity book, check pages from the activity book, pages 48, 49, exercises, exercise one, uh, page 50, exercises one and two, uh, page 52, yes, exercises one and two, page uh, 53, page 54 and page 55, all from the activity book, ok? Um, les mandé un mensaje por el whatsapp de, de papás, ¿sí? del instituto, Reino Unido, ya sabemos, les mandé un mensaje a los papás para que les avisen que estas eran las páginas de homework, porque en la foto pizarra hubo un error al pasar de nuestro plan, miramos los planes, miramos el plan siguiente, ¿Sí? Nos equivocamos al mirar el plan, entonces pasamos mal en la foto pizarra las páginas, las pages de homework. Así que pasé y les, eh, los papás les habrán avisado, por eso tienen bien. Y si no tienen bien es porque le avisaron mal los papás. No le avisaron los papás, pero creo que todos los, los papás habrán avisado eso porque les pedí por favor que avisen. 48, let's, I tell you how we are going to organize. We are going to check the pages and then I'm going to explain uh, the revision, ¿ok? I'm going to explain the revision on unit 3 and 4. Okay, is it clear? Yes? Good, good, good. We are going to see the explanation there. Okay. Good. And we are going to do the listening, porque tenemos listening también hoy. Así que sí o sí tenés que estar viendo esto, más las instrucciones de la revision, más los listening, porque si no, si no lo ven, no vas a poder hacer los listening. Okay? Let's go. Okay, number one. 1F, 2B, and D, 3A and C, ok, 3A and C, ok, the jobs with the pictures, ok, you know, the Queen's Piper, a professional tea taster, and the Raven Master, ok, 1F, 2B, and D, 3A and C, ok, let's go to exercise 2, 2, 6, 3, 15, 4, 300, 5 and 9. Yes, ok, good. Uh, well, so you have to imagine you have a job there, one of the jobs in activity 1, and write about you. I am a tea taster. I must try, try is provide different teas. I wear a uniform, can be. I like my job because I like Tasting teas, or I like teas, okay? Good. Uno de los de arriba, yes, okay? You choose, it's private, yes, okay? Let's go to page 49. Okay, one. Are you there? My sister can't move. My granny's leg is hurt. There is a burglar in my neighbor's house. Yes, okay. Uh, only exercise one. Page 50, exercise 1 and 2. Yes, are you there? Okay, number 2. Video, game animator. Rocket engineer for Sue Bet. Number 2. He or she must draw the person. 3. He or she takes care of birds, snakes, turtles, giraffes and elephants. Acordate de ponerle bien la S. Takes care. Yes. Number four. You move a pair of gloves. You move a pair of gloves. Five. He or she looks at the design. He or she looks at the design. Yes. Okay. Siempre te tienes que ir al reading que está en la in the class book. Okay. Good. So let's go to uh, page fifty two. Yes. Okay. Fifty two. There we are. 
Ok, so it's jobs there. You have to circle the jobs. Dale, te digo todo lo que teníamos que hacer circle, ok? Jobs, vets, chefs, chefs, waiters, waitresses, firefighters, police officers. Rules. You must wear a uniform, a job uniform. You mustn't be late. You must wash them, the teddy bears, but they mustn't feed them. You must buy food and drinks, yes? You must be clean. You must clean the tables and put any litter in the bin. You must wear their uniforms. Everybody must follow their rules, okay? Y en el ejercicio 2, ¿qué tenías que hacer vos? Ahí están las rules que subrayamos de Jobs Day el día de los eh, diferentes trabajos. And in exercise 2, ¿qué tenés que hacer vos? You, uh, today's job day at our school. It's a lot of fun. You must wear a uniform. You mustn't, you mustn't be late. Years 1 and 2. ¿Qué deben hacer los years 1 and 2? Yes. Are working as best. Ok. Vos vas a elegir qué años del cole, primer grado, segundo grado, tercero, cuarto, quinto y sexto, ¿Qué van a, ¿De qué profesión van a trabajar? Como el texto de arriba. Por ejemplo, Years 1 and 2, yes, are working as teacher. Yes, as teachers. Yes, ok. Uh, they must wear a uniform. They must wear, uh, they must teach a subject. Yes, ok. Years 3 and 4 are working as waitresses or waiter. Yes, they must wear a uniform. They must uh, serve different food and drinks. Years five and six uh, are working as um, vets. As vets, they are wearing uniform, a uniform. Uh, they are looking after different animals. Okay, good. And that's all. Vos te imaginas y uh, separas qué año, qué años van a ser de qué profesión. De tal o cual profesión. Number, uh, page 53. Two actresses. Actress, three. Chef, four. Bus driver. Exercise, three. What are the children doing in the river? Three. My friends aren't having lunch in the canteen. Four. Mom is taking the, the car to the mechanic. Five. Is the musician playing the piano in the theater? And number four, you have, uh, this is true or false, read and write true or false, yes, okay? You must wear a uniform, true or false. You mustn't have lunch at school, true or false, esto depende de vos. You mustn't be late for school, fine, you inventate dos más, yes, okay? You mustn't uh, speak when the teacher is giving the class, you mustn't speak in class, You mustn't use the phone, the cell phone, okay? Don't must, okay? Let's go to page 54. 54. Te queda la parte de traducción como en todas las unidades que esto te queda a vos, yes? Para que tengas, para que estudies. Arrive on time, break the rules, no romper las reglas, tirar, arrojar basura, follow the rules, put the litter in the bin. Acordate, put the litter in the bin. Yes, don't, you mustn't drop litter on the floor. Yes, okay. You mustn't shout in class. Ah! No. You must put your hand up, raise your hand to speak in the class. Yes, okay, y todas las profesiones. Después aquí, completa con la gramática. Yes, okay. Is it clear? Good. Present continuous activities we are doing now. Yes, he or she is. Yes, we are. We, you, they are. Number three. Yes, isn't. Yes, okay. Flying a kite. Yes, okay. Am I playing the piano? Is she or he washing the car? Yes, I am. No, I am not. Este cuadrito es súper fácil. Y después es 55. Yes, number two, drinking. Number three, difficult exercises. Number four, school. Number five, exciting. Exercise two. Ok, are you there? 
Two, chef. Three, cooking. Four, dangerous. Five, listening. Acuérdate que está two music. Six, cows. Okay? And that is all. Okay? This, uh, if you need the repetition, you must rewind your video. Yes? Okay? Is it clear? Y esta semana, ya con esta revisión, le decimos bye bye unit 3 uh, and 4. And next class, we are going to say hello to unit 5. Bueno, no tan rápido, pero viene la parte de corrección de mistakes y todo eso. Pero pronto, pronto. Yes? Okay? Well, so let's go to. Um, let's go to the revision. Okay? Revision. Yes, okay, revision, revision, revision. Okay, there we are. Wait a minute. Ok, vas a tener el, el documento, ¿sí? Siempre me vas a mandar el PDF, yes, good, there we are. One, track 11. Ok, so this is the revision, yes, that you will have there. Yes, it's a very beautiful revision. Yes, okay. It's done for you. Genial. Okay, in the first part. You have to correct the mistakes. Remember the technique. Remember the technique. Read all the sentences first. Read all the sentences first. Okay? Correct the mistakes. Teacher Nicole is tallest than teacher Ruth. Analiza. Cuando tenías un comparativo y está el dan, ¿qué le agregamos a ese, a ese um, adjetivo? Yes? Shorter than. Teacher Ruth is the shortest in the class. Si es un superlativo. Ahora, si quieres decir un superlativo con un adjetivo largo, teacher Ruth is the most beautiful in the class. Yes, ok. Formosa is the most popular city in Argentina. Formosa is more popular than Chaco. Chaco is more interesting than Formosa. Chaco is smaller than Formosa. Y así... Bigger than Formosa. Entonces, acordate todas esas cositas y fíjate los tips, las, 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 las um, trampitas que hay ahí, ¿sí? ¿yes? O sea, las guías, mejor dicho, no trampitas. ¿Está? Do you like the beach? Because it's relaxing. Acá responde, esto es una pista, ahí responde con because. ¿Cómo se preguntaba cada vez que preguntaba? que la respuesta era because. What o why? No te puedo decir más nada. Who is the... Acordate las pistitas. De. Cuando teníamos de, nos está indicando que es un comparative o un superlative. Un superlative. Well done. A bet, look after animals. Acordate cómo va el verbo cuando está el más. I must speak. I must Talk, I must drop, I must put the letter in the bin. Yes, ok, I must study. El verbo en infinitivo, con ninguna otra cosa rara, ¿eh? En infinitivo, sin el to, sin ing. I must study. Acordate cuando es he, she o it, el verbo lleva s. A teacher looks after students. 
A teacher teaches in class. A teacher speaks in English. A bat looks after animals. Pay attention. Ok, no te puedo dar más pistas. A ver si vos te tenés que estar atento. Choose the correct alternative. Yes, choose the correct alternative. Yes. Elijo la alternativa correcta and write it in the space. I a doctor in the future. I want to be a doctor. I wanted to be a doctor or I want to be a doctor. La respuesta correcta la vas a hacer un circulito y vas a a escribir en el espacio. Ojo, ¿eh? Analiza cada cosa. ¿Cómo iban los... Uh, si yo digo, I speak. I speak. ¿Loud o loudly? Muy bien, loudly. I cook. Quick o quickly. Quickly. Acordate que todo lo que termina en li es el adverbio. Y como cuando vos estás con un verbo, al lado de un verbo va a ir un adverbio. Lo que modifica un verbo es un adverbio. ¿Cómo nadás? Rápidamente. ¿Cómo corres? Lentamente. Así que, ojo, ¿eh? ¿Cuándo vas a elegir una cosa u otra? El presente continuo, cuando decimos at this moment, now, I am cooking, I am sleeping. Are you drinking mate? Am um, aroís más el verbo con ing. Complete the crossword. Mirás los dibujitos y completás. Sin mirar nada. Re Por eso ya dijimos que estudies. No hagas trampa. River, mountain. Listen and write the number. Ya lo vamos a hacer juntos, el listening. Yo te lo voy a pasar. Look and complete. Ahí completás. Las professions. Check, lo que sea. Controlá. Complete the following sentences. Y acá, acordate. Mount Everest is the, si pones de, ¿qué viene? Y acá al lado tenés el, ¿qué cosa? El adjetivo que vas a poner en superlativo o comparativo. Is the most high? Is the highest? Y ahí vas a acordarte si es un adjetivo corto o largo. Si quiero formar el superlativo voy a agregar est, the shortest, the smallest, ¿ok? Who is intelligent? Tengo algo ahí. Y dice, your dad o your mom. Te está dando que compares dos cosas. Entonces, tenés que usar un comparativo. Es largo. Entonces, cuando era largo, ¿qué tengo que poner? More beautiful than. Te estoy dando todos los tips, ¿eh? Así que fíjate, por favor. Presta atención. Lo revisamos en clase. Yes, ok. ¿Cuándo usamos the litter in the street? Ok, acá tenés el verbo y tenés que poner el negativo. ¿Cómo negamos? Debes. I must. I mustn't. Ok. I mustn't. Yes, be late. I mustn't drop litter in the street. I must study. Mm. What are your mom and dad doing? Ojo, eh? what is your sister doing? A singer, yes, sings beautiful songs. A bed looks after animals. A chef cooks delicious food. Estamos ahí con, en presencia de presente simple. Cuando es he, she o he, el verbo lleva ese. Muy bien, tenemos listen and choose que vamos a hacer con la teacher. Y acá tenés el leaflet. Mira, te toca hacer un leaflet. Acerca de tu ciudad. ¿Ves que acá tenés esto? Acá pones poner formosa. Is beautiful. Yes. Come to formosa. Come to formosa. Formosa. Is the best. ¿Ok? Y así vas a llenar hasta completar con 30 palabras. 30 words. Ojo, ¿eh? Por eso tenés que estar viendo el instructivo, porque no podés ir a hacer el, 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 la revision sin ver el instructivo. Por eso el instructivo va a salir 20 minutos, 30 minutos más tarde, para que vos veas el video sí o sí. 
y no haga macana. Yes, ok. Y así vas a hacer. Uh, visit Formosa. Formosa is the most beautiful, is the most beautiful city in the world. Yes, ok. Uh, Formosa is the hottest place in the world. Y vas a usar diferentes frases para completar ese leaflet, ese panfleto que va a auspiciar Formosa, que va a hacer que la gente quiera venir a Formosa. Ojo, controla, frase por frase antes de entregar. Si están puntos, los puntos, si están las mayúsculas, ¿sí? es capital letters, puntos, comas, ¿ok? Yes, good. No puedo dar más ejemplos, pero ahí ya te puse las cositas de cómo tenés que hacer. Ya hicimos un leaflet. ¿Está? Oraciones cortas, bien armadas. Pensá si quieres comparar. Formosa is better than uh, the other cities. Yes, ok. Formosa is the hottest. Formosa is the hottest. Después dice, read and write true or false. You read the text, read the sentences and write true or false. Verdadero o falso y ahí termina. Ok, vamos al listening. Let's go to the listening. Listen and write the number. ¿Estás listo? Ready? Listen and write the number. Permiso, se sienta un rato la teacher. Tiene que poner los listening. All right. Here we are. One. If you need the repetition, ¿qué vas a hacer en casa? Vas a rewind the video, retroceder el video and play it again. You must follow the rules in class. First of all, ¿qué es lo que primero tenés que hacer? Mirar las fotos. Look at the photos. Look at the photos. Yes? Entonces identificas qué, va, qué, qué estás, what are you waiting for? Okay. ¿Qué estás esperando? ¿Qué esperas escuchar? Te imaginas. One. You must follow the rules Put the in numbers. class. Put, the numbers Put your here. hand up yeah. when you want to talk to the teacher. Okay. Remember to put the names here, the numbers here. Ahí en ese cuadrito, okay? Now there we go. One. You must follow the rules in class. Put your hand up when you want to talk to the teacher. Two. You mustn't drop litter on the classroom floor. Three. Don't run. You mustn't break the school rules. Four. You mustn't shout in class. Five. School starts at nine o'clock. You mustn't be late. Six. Keep the classroom tidy. You must put litter in the bin. Seven. You must be quiet when you're working in class. Eight. You must arrive at school on time every day. All right. There we are. Yes, if you want to listen again, remember to rewind the video and play it again. Let's go to the other listening. Let's go to the other listening. Ta, 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 ta. There we are. Okay, listen and choose. You have to circle, yes? Choose. One of the two options. What's the most exciting city? London or Paris? What's more delicious? Delicious. Milk or lemonade? What's the most beautiful animal? Uh, animal, elephants or tigers, and what's more interesting, watching TV or reading a book? 
What's the most boring subject at school? Music or math? Listen carefully. No te apures en redondear. Escucha toda la frase siempre, ¿eh? Yes? There we are. Track 9. 1. What's the most exciting city? Well, Paris is exciting, but I think London is the most exciting city of all. One. What's the most exciting city? Well, Paris is exciting, but I think London is the most exciting city of all. Two. What's more delicious, milk or lemonade? Well, milk is delicious, but I think lemonade is more delicious. Pay attention. Three. What's the most beautiful animal? That's difficult. Elephants are very beautiful, but tigers are the most beautiful of all. They're my favorite animal. Four. What's more interesting, watching TV or reading a book? I like watching TV, but I love books. I read every day, so reading is the most interesting. Five. What's the most boring subject at school? I don't like maths. It's very boring. But I think that music is the most boring of all. I can't play the piano. Okay, well, that is all. Yes, that is all. That was, uh, the, that were, those were the two listening. Yes, I hope you concentrate. Yes, uh, seguro mandenme todo como siempre. Estas ya son las um, revision. Esta ya es la revision on unit three and four. Todos ya saben cómo mandar el PDF. Ya han practicado las otras que han entregado, así que va a venir todo perfecto. Um, van a tener el horario y el día para entregar. Yes, okay. Happy weekend. See you next class. Bye bye. Have a great kisses from the teacher.